An 18 month progress report on the energy action plan has just been released. Crazy to think that our energy crisis solution is old enough to be a toddler now. The report from the presidency speaks about the strides made since the EAP's announcement in July 2022. Achievements such as improving ESCOM's capacity, encouraging private investment, getting new energy sources quicker, promoting rooftop solar, and revamping the energy sector for long-term stability, all five of which are the main goals of the EAP. Over the last six months alone, they can proudly welcome back the Kusile power station unit, as well as doubling roof rooftop solar installations, connection of rooftop solar battery storage projects, and getting a lot of energy from the bid windows. The government has also successfully launched the cross-border standard offer program and implemented ESCOM's standard offer program. Then there's the first of its kind and largest battery energy storage system project, not just in South Africa, but in the whole of the continent. Unlocking more grid capacity in the Cape region, the appointment of the independent board for the National Transmission Company of South Africa, and the finalization of the National wheeling framework ensuring fair access for delivering electricity to everyone without discrimination. To top it off, the ERA bill has passed in the National Assembly and is now being considered in the National Council of Provinces. There's still a long way to go and as much as the report feels like the government's patting itself on the back, there has been some serious progress made. Let's keep it going.